Hey guys, it is me, Phoenix. We are going to do a general read to see what your energy is. Please do me a favor, like, share, subscribe, hit the bell notification to be notified when I post a new video. Remember, red hearts if you made it through, purple hearts if it resonates, green hearts if you're working on it, yellow hearts you rock with me, got my six, Nina have my back, because I have yours. You're manifesting something you dreamt about, love. And at the bottom of the deck is answers. You're receiving the answers that you were looking for when it comes to the manifestation and love. But are you ready to receive them? That's what you need to ask yourself. And those are the answers that um, are coming into question when it comes to manifestation. Let's see what you are manifesting. Um, if you see, I pulled the cards a little bit different. Yeah. Um, see, based upon the past energies, manifestation comes from experiencing from learning from the past and also understanding where you felt and the burdens that you felt or the type of energies like the sad energies the endings that you had to have and where you had to step up for yourself queen of swords energy and make head over heart decisions and set clear boundaries so you can manifest a lot of things but i think moving forward the answers that you're going to receive when it comes to manifestation is first of all how you're going to set boundaries when it comes to love because that was an energy that you had to deal with in the past and so the cards that come out are yeah the empress and the death energy so yeah seeing the beauty in yourself but with the empress being here you had to create but in order to create you had to end things that no longer served you so when it came to love the way that you loved in the past is going to be different from the um from the present moment based upon the past energies now you're not going to be bitter you're not going to be um sad or scared or afraid you're just going to politely say the things that you want and move forward because you are going after your dreams and one of your dreams is to love but you have to be able to trust that love is going to give you everything that you wanted and that's the completion that you need to have and that's the answers that you receive you're learning from the past and you're moving forward towards the present moment now i want to go ahead and clarify the death energy and the ten of swords we're going to look at what the past uh, energies did to you mentally physically and emotion emotionally but at that same time not to revisit the past but to learn um, or to listen to what we learned from the past and again take what resonates leave what does them but again seeing the beauty in yourself and being able to create the things that uh, you couldn't uh, ahead of time or being afraid to manifest based upon things of the past we're clarifying the ten of swords yeah the ten of swords comes out unsure with a couple of yeah being optimistic and also knowing that you're going to have success uh, when it comes to the six of wands and the star energy it also shows that you are unsure about the burdens and the completions and also um, uh, with the moon energy being here you're unsure about wanting to remember the past you know so it's like oh here we go again I don't want to I don't want to remember how I gave to a situation or how I was so naive Queen of Pentacles energy Queen of Pentacles the loving family is one of the greatest blessings in life protect and care for them no matter what so the past um, memories are something that you're trying to avoid but in order for you to go forward or move forward in life you have to learn from the past and that's the reason why these cards did come out which is being optimistic in regards to the pain and also um, knowing that you're going to be successful so that's kind of how I see that and that's where you have to look at and thank the past energies and the past people and situations that came into your life because they're causing you to understand and to be successful and to be able to still dream big and to love hard and to still want to manifest about love what you really dreamed about uh, a while you know what you really dreamed about as a child or uh, what you really wanted uh, from a certain situation but it took for you to strengthen your being have completion and go from there and really learn from your burdens and be able to create now creation again with the death energy being here there had to be change so in order for you to manifest this love and be able to create it you had to change the way that you did things so we're going to clarify the death energy
the death energy comes out with the page of swords yeah clarity so again you had to have clarity on what the what what happened in the past learning from the past and moving forward in the present moment and that's why the page of swords shows its face because with the page of swords these are new ideas and you have to be curious on and and curiosity makes it uh, makes you step stagnant um in regards to this thing called love because you're curious about the future with a person place thing or a new situation uh, because you've been so worried about the past and so to always remember those things and like Rafiki says um what you know what, what Simba said to Rafiki why you hit me he said doesn't matter it's in the past the past can't hurt you can either run from it or you can learn from it and that's where the curiosity of where you are right now and the answers that you want and the completions that you had to have in order to move forward um if that makes sense and so with the two of swords we'll go ahead and clarify that yeah it, it's it, it's you know it's a, a painful thing to have to keep reliving and understanding but page of wands energy yesterday is history tomorrow's a mystery the only thing that's real is the present moment so you're in this present moment and understanding what you need to trust in the page of pentacles of doing the work and that you can have your cake and eat it too uh nine of cups energy again the nine of cups energy is your wish card your dreams and so if you trust in yourself you know that you and live in the present moment the completions will happen as long as you understand your ability to create and that is the answers that you needed to uh, receive in regards to this read so short but sweet I think that's a really good thing I'm going to go ahead and put the four a uh, pull from the four agreements if you want to know my perspective of the four agreements click the link up here also with the crystal deck but yeah you just had to learn from your past so the answers that you want to receive or you wanted to receive about love are right there don't take anything personal like I said learn from the past say thank you because no man is your enemy no man is your friend every man is your teacher which means lessons work jobs or whatever is related to a lesson that caused you some type of pain but it's a lesson it says refuse to eat emotional poison taking things personally makes you pray for predators they can hook your attention with one little opinion and feed you whatever poison they want refuse to eat the poison and so that is what you're doing moving forward you're not going to let anything stop you you're going to realize why you had to get to this point and you're going to constantly manifest and what people some people call this is um a hopeless romantic but no you just believe in love and you want that but sometimes it causes you to go into hermit mode and not want it but everybody deserves love so you just have to be able to know and learn from the things that you went through in order for you to move forward we have the blue blue sapphires here crown third eye and throat chakra crown third eye and throat chakra it says self-expression wisdom and clarity self-expression wisdom and clarity and it says my actions are guided by wisdom and awareness learning from the past that's the answers that you needed to have in order to move forward so that are the those are the answers that you needed to know now let's let the past energy go and live in the present moment i now let go of worn out conditions of lacked out hate negativity procrastination stagnation sadness generational curses debt bad energies heartbreak bad health and addictions remember addictions can be to a person place thing or a situation i love you guys